Hi, this is Peter Newman. I'm going to mesh that, uh, that pipe and valve one more time. And this time I'm going to do it with a partial mesh. What I mean is I've meshed all three fluid, pipe and valve, and I've uh, meshed just the fluid. Now I'm going to try and mesh uh, the fluid and the pipe and not the valve and see if that gets us into trouble. And I think it does. So there's the valve in the center. So let's imagine we want to mesh on the pipe for heat transfer reasons. So we'll go through the standard capping of the ends. So inlet and pick the cap and close one end and the outlet and uh, take that identify regions the fluid by numerical 10 identify the pipe the pipe region will be by zone so we have a pipe body and that is going to be meshed as fluid so that I get uh, a mesh even though it's a solid object and uh, the valve is going to be meshed as a void and that is by zone and we have a valve body so there is no leakage we'll update that but there here's where something is uh, has caused problems error message since you have defined both wrap and surface mesh and extraction methods you must define at least one construction surface so this workflow does not flow and I don't know if we can just switch that to wrap and make it go but uh, maybe that helped there you go. So let's uh, update the mesh and the proximity, as you remember, was edited. And um, point zero three update boundary layers. We'll skip boundary layers and see if we get a uh, surface mesh. Nope, so the error continues to persist. Um, so there is a defect in the workflow if I want a mesh on the fluid and the pipe but not on the valve. So there's a... Uh, I'm calling this a, a bug in the beta release. Thanks for watching.